In olden times, two friends lived in a village. The name of one was Kalu and the other was Dhanna. Both loved each other very much. They worked together, ate together with what they earned, and shared in happiness and sorrow. Both used to work whole day. Once there was a drought in the village. For the whole year, not even a drop of water had fallen. All the wells had dried up. Humans, animals, birds were dying without water. Kalu was a good magician. Not only his villagers, but other people from far and wide also used to come to see his magic. One day both the friends went to cut the grass. Kalu had to sharpen his knife, but there was no water to be seen anywhere. In such a situation, Kalu entered the forest and by the power of magic, extracted water from the ground. Taking it, he came to his friend, Dhanna. Dhanna was very surprised. Where did you get this water from? He asked Kalu. From within the forest, answered Kalu. Dhanna said, Look, I am your best friend. Please teach me this magic too. Kalu said, My friend, I have no doubt on your friendship. But, my Guruji said that not every knowledge can be taught to every person. Dhanna said, Well, then I am not fit to learn magic. And both started arguing. In this displeasure, he beheaded his friend. He buried Kalu's torso there and came home with his head. At home, he hanged Kalu's head on a pole. Kalu's head used to talk many things to Dhanna at night. Fearing this, Dhanna left the village and ran away. He reached another village. There he married and lived comfortably. After some time, a daughter was born to her. She was a beautiful girl, everyone loved her. Once suddenly, the girl fell ill. Dhanna treated him a lot. But he was not relieved by any medicine. Sad and tired, Dhanna went to bed early one night. In his deep sleep he saw a dream. In the dream the severed head of his friend, Kalu, said to him, Push this head in the ground, a tree will grow from it. When fruits come on it, then pluck that fruit. On cutting that fruit, water will come out inside it. Give that water to your daughter, she will be fine. Dhanna's sleep was disturbed. He reached his old village in the dark, running. He buried Kalu's head, which was hanging on a pillar in the house, in the ground as per his instructions. After some time from that head, a tree was born. It bore fruit. Dhanna cut the fruit from the middle and took out the water and gave it to the daughter. Within a few days, the girl was completely cured. Dhanna was overjoyed to see him healthy. Then he felt sad that he killed a well-wishing friend like Kalu. Like the video and subscribe the channel.